Greetings Mortals viewers alike, my name is Cyborg15 and this is Persona 4 Golden. Let's get back into this. Alright, we are back. What are we doing tonight? Alright, I thought we can hang out with Dojima. Which I think I might do. Let's just take a look at this. Six days. Alright, now it's fine. Dojima. Hey. Hey, you, what's wrong, board? Since you have Shisa, Persona of the Hierophants, I'm counting you to make it long well. If you know your relationship with Dojima, has got to become closer soon. Yes, I will. Ah. Uh. Dojima sighs, but he looks a bit happy. Hmm. I heard something at the station the other day about, well, I heard you guys hang out at Junets pretty often. Dojima's probing stare hurts. Nothing wrong with that, of course. The question is, why do you make so many trips to and from the electronics department? Man, why are you angry? Dad. Oh, uh, it isn't what you think. We're not interrogating him. It's not fair. You're always talking with Big Bro. What? I mean, today you're home, but... I always talk with you. When is always? Oof! I... I wanna talk. Nanako rubs her eyes deeply as she says it. So it's bedtime for you already. Gotta see if I'll play with you next time. Oof! Okay. Dojima. We, we need to have a talk, you and I, about your, uh... Your daughter's six years old. She needs you. There's things more important than your job. There are other detectives in Nina, but they can handle the things. Your daughter needs you. You promised. Nanako reluctantly returns to her room. Man. When is always, huh? Yeah, I, I feel sorry for her. Why not play with her, Chief? <sighs> ah, no, that's not. A, that's no excuse. Dojima grimaces. Truth is, I mostly left raising her up to my wife, her mother. So I don't really know how to approach her. Plus, I'm not fit to be her family. Yes, you are. Fit or not, you're family. Hmm. Maybe you're right. Dojima smiling wryly. You think that just being related by blood makes you family? Well. Technically speaking, yes. No, sure. There are some family members. There are some times when you want to distance yourself from your family because they are a hole. Okay, first of all, guys, this, this is not me. I have a good relationship with almost everyone in my family. Like I have, I have no bad relationship with anyone in my family. But I do know that there are some people who don't, who want to distance themselves from their family members because I don't know they've got toxic family members and so on and so forth. That's not the case. In field, you begin to grasp the worries of the gym the gym carries within her. I, I know that it's not as simple as uh, she's your daughter, just hang out with her. But, you know, you should make a concerted effort. Especially since she's still a growing child and has no other parental figure to look towards. Sorry. Oh, uh, sorry. You didn't need to hear about Night. that. Get some sleep. Night. So I was actually thinking that it was going to be a little bit longer until we got into this actual part of the story. I was thinking maybe around rank 5 or 6. Oh, the instant noodles really hit the spot. You know, the rainy season's just about here. Uh -huh. Isn't it a little early? Once it starts, it'll be raining every night. We'll have to keep a constant eye on the midnight channel. Crap, I didn't even think of that. Well, so it goes. <laughs> I thought you were worried about the rain because of the school camp out. Why are you so excited about that? Damn it, Yosuke. That's right, it's the first time for you two. Yes, yes it is. You realize the only purpose of the school camp out is to develop a love for one's hometown and young people, right? Yeah, they tell us that up front, so? Well, you see, the way we supposedly develop that love is by picking up trash off the mountain. Picking up trash? Develop a love my ass. That's slave labor. It is. Well, the night's kind of fun. 
We cook our own meals with mess kits and sleep in tents. Um, Yosuke and I, we're, we are the chefs, right? Me and Yosuke are the chefs. The four of us are in the same group. The same group, huh? Does that mean we sleep together at night, too? Damn it, Yosuke. You wish. Guys and girls sleep in different tents. I'm warning you. If you leave your tent at night, you'll be expelled on the spot. And this gets worse and worse. I thought it was going to be fun. Wow, Yosuke. The thirst is real for you, Chief. It's only for one night, and we disband before noon the next day. It doesn't last very long. Oh, we did have some fun at the river before going home last year. Do they let you go swimming? I think so. There's always someone who takes a dip, although we didn't. I see. So you can swim in the river. Oh, I've got a lot of ideas for the thumbnail of this video if we get to do the whole camp, the camp thing in this video. Like, there are too many thumbnails that I can do for this video. There are too many thumbnails, guys. It's actually going to be fun. Hey, Narukami, did you know this week is health week? And you're not part of a student health association. In other words, you're a lazy bum. I hate lazy, good-for-nothing kids like you. So I'm um, signing you up to take the place of a sick member. Uh, wait! That's not fair. Quiet, you. I don't know what school life's... Uh, school life's school's like for you big city kids, but here, it's every st student's duty to pitch in. Don't tell me you're not uh, you're not enough of a man to do something this easy. I'll do it. I see, I see. They go straight to the infirmary right now. They should be expecting you since I already told them you'd do it. Thank me. I think I'm getting a new confidant today. Good luck. Thank you. I... Yeah, it'll be fine. I'm just... I'm pretty sure I'm just using this to grab a new confidant. Oh, you can. Was it the transfer student, right? Did you get hurt or something? You told them that you've been sent here to replace a sick member. Oh, thank goodness. We're running low on people. Uh, we should... Ch uh, we need to check around school to see if anyone needs help, but... But someone has to stay and watch this room. You can. Would you mind staying here and dealing with anyone that stops by? No touching the medicine, of course. If someone who hurts shows by, use the first aid kit. And on, it, the only other things you'd have to worry about are the salesmen and phone calls. They're pretty uncommon, though. The Student Health Association stood up throughout the school. Question mark, someone's here. Hello there. Hi, I'm, I'm Kitayo from Santo Pharmaceuticals. Okay, you're not the person I was thinking of. You're not a confidant, I'm pretty sure. There aren't any adults here. Could you deliver a message for me, then? Your school placed an order for gauze, but I need to know if the order can wait until the month after the next. Give my regards to your teacher. Thanks for your help. Anything happen? I told her about the representative from the pharmaceutical, from the pharmaceutical company came. Oh, we should have Sensei call him. Oh, do you remember his name? Uh... Um... Kitano? I feel like I said Kitano. Ah, about Gaza, what did he say? Um, okay, next month. Hmm, got it, I'll call Sensei. You had her relay the message to the teacher. You got his message wrong, he corrected me. <laughs> ah, bollocks. You gave them the wrong information and burst the teacher. Dang it, I was wrong. Alright, let's discuss what we found while we were... We all we went around the school. Okay, group one. Oh, that's right. You went alone. Yeah, Kunishi. Yeah. Okay, I had a feeling. Oh yeah, Kunishi can. He can't help it after what happened. That poor thing. So you just have to have to do his part too. Hey guys. I'm am sorry I'm late. No, it's okay. I think uh, younger Konishi over here is hanged man or Kana. We don't have to come, really. Helping out at your parents' store is hard work, right? We have a replacement, so don't worry. It's not the... Okay. I don't want to be the only one. Well, you can help you can clean up this room, then. We'll go report to a teacher, so why don't you come clean a little and go home, okay? Well, goodbye. Hi, I'm Konishi, first year. You knew Saki Konishi, I'm her brother. You're friends with Hanamura, right? I hate him, and you too. Okay. 
Can I go home now? I mean, look. Under normal circumstances, I would have said sure. But then you said you hate me. So... I... I, I genuinely don't know why it is that you hate me. Help me clean, Chief. I have to help out at home. It's a mess, you understand, right? Fine, you can go home. Goodbye. I'll search your comfort on later. You did your part and helped the health Student Health Association as ordered. The other members didn't return, so you decided to go home. Maybe you should have forced him to help me. I think that might have started a confidant. Oh, well. Tutoring job spent with Yosuke. Uh, let's go hang out with Yosuke. Because we need to increase his stats for the uh, for um so that next time we hang out with him oh wait did I buy things Item exchange. Festival. Ooh. Show info. Plus 50 SP. So wait, hold on. Uh, equip. Uh, oh, actually, I forgot to take a look at Susaku Feather. Okay, yeah, so never mind, it does exactly the same thing. As long as I'm here, let's quickly take a look at Mr. Tatsumi. Status, Kanji. Okay, so Mazio, Zionga, Rakukaja, Kill Rush, Regenerate. Kill Rush, Life Physical Damage to one foe, uh, one to three times. Mazio and Zionga, that's not bad. You're gonna get Elect Boost next. Actually, pretty cash money. Alright. Uh. Okay. So, yeah, Yukiko's basically already got a fan that does the same thing as what you're offering me. Let's take a look. What else do you have for me? Uh. Yeah, okay, you have nothing for me. Yosuke Hanamura, where are you? You should be, like, at the top there. There you are. Huh? Yo, you, what are you doing here? Just got off my shift. If you're bored, maybe, uh, maybe you wouldn't mind talking for a while. Yosuke seems bored. You might appreciate Yes. Alright. <laughs> eh, my back. Damn, it hurts to do anything. I understand that Yosuke, and I'm only 23, much cry. <laughs> you know how it's been raining nonstop lately? I've had my hands full keeping the store floors clean. And part-timers slack off on it, saying it's too much trouble, so I end up having to do it myself. Yeah, you got the short end of the stick. <laughs> <laughs> yep, it would be no joke if a customer fell and hurt themselves. Yes, case often. Well, I just try to have have to stick through, stick with it the, uh, through the rainy season. And you know what they say: the danger, uh, the danger passed and got forgotten, huh? Oh, speaking of rainy season, just the other day. Enjoy your idle chat with Yosuke. You feel that your relationship is strong? Yay! My relationship could go stronger huh? soon. You can have this. Ooh, royal jelly. Thank you. Night. Uh, ah, it is rainy day tonight, but no one has appeal, appeared on the news. It's June already, huh? Well, good news. Tatsumi-kun 
from the first year is back with us and try to set good examples. I know it's the rainy season, but you may not be and you may not be very motivated. But let's keep our spirits up, okay? All right. I really hate this weather since I can't go out and exercise. But watching sports on TV isn't bad either. I saw a hake and die competition the other day. Uh, they do beautiful moves with delicate sense of balance, though. I can see why men would be afraid to try it. Haha. <laughs> hey, you can. What's a hake and die? That is a. Okay, I think it might be a balance beam type of thing. Let me just consult my classroom answers. Uh, where are my answer? What day is it today? Today is the sixth of the, uh, the eighth of the sixth. Balance beam. So I was right. You gave her the answer you think is correct. Wow, I'm amazed you knew that you. But you should ask me if you have questions. You can coach on not him. Balance beam is heck and die in Japanese. I bet you kids hear the word beam and you think about lasers or something, but it refers to timber or beam. The balancing on a wooden beam is might is mighty tricky. Boom, the, sp uh, the sport of balance beam is born. Oh, I never thought about it that way. Interesting. You're a smart guy. You can thank you. Yay. Will expression. Yeah, no. Hey, guess what I just heard? I'm getting flashbacks to Ryuji appearing in front of me. With the Maid Cafe uh, poster. And <laughs> I feel like Yosuke is about to do something similar. When they're sitting in back of you, it's like a squeeze play! Damn it, Yosuke! Putting a baseball team together? No, not that kind of squeeze. I guess it's more like smooshing. Sorry, I got ahead of myself. What I mean is... I'm talking about how when there's a girl sitting behind you on a motorcycle, they press right up against your back! <laughs> you just being completely oblivious to what he's talking about. Um, is this a baseball or motocross? I told you already, that's not what I'm talking about! Don't make me repeat myself! Anyway, I think motorcycles are the hot new thing for guys now. Girls like guys who spend time outdoors, right? So I got you this. Want to get your license with me, partner? It's the manual for getting a motorcycle license. Well, I can't afford anything bigger than a scooter on my budget. But at least that'll let us get to new places. Alright, at least they acknowledge that they're not actually getting motorcycles, they're getting scooters. Don't you think we deserve that much, seeing as how we're investigating the case? Yosuke seems serious about this. Sup, senpai? Hey, about the camping trip, you guys busy right now? Kinda. We're talking about motorcycles. Motorcycles? You gonna go stomp a gang? <laughs> if you're bringing a war, I'll help. No, we're not bringing a war. What does that mean, anyway? We're just talking about getting motorcycle licenses. Licenses? You guys don't have yours? Huh? No way! Don't tell me you are a- Nah, I'm still 15 and all. Then why'd you say it like that? Man, that reminds me. I'm surprised you picked a fight with that biker gang. How'd you chase after them? Eh, a bike's all I need for that. In any case, we can't let you in on our up-close-and-personal plan. Up-close-and-personal? What does that mean? <laughs> I, I noticed all those two girls in the background. Oh, let me just use my mouse. These ones, right here. Notice the moment they turn towards us the moment you can't just start yelling. Keep it down! Like I was telling this guy, what a guy needs nowadays to be a big man is first, a motorcycle. And then... And then... A girlfriend. Um, I'm working on that. Like... No, oh, no, 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 okay, I'm, that's not, that's, no, no, that, that's not, that's not nice. Tell me more. Now that's my partner. All right, then. You guys gonna get licensed for the big stuff? I mean, I know I came in late here, but if you're talking about taking a girl on a bike, 
You gotta be seating too, man. That ain't allowed on a scooter. I forgot about that. <laughs> God, you're just bringing in the facts. Shut up, this'll work out. Not run. As long as we have a motorcycle, the girls will come running. That's all the advantage we'll need. Yes, Kate, okay, look, I don't wanna I don't wanna tell you the bad news. But you are literally the magician arcana. Yeah, you're the magician Ar you're the magician arcana. Like, Chief, you're not gonna have a good romance luck. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Now listen carefully. The reason we don't have girlfriends is because we're stuck here in this town waiting to meet someone. I mean, I just haven't tr I just haven't met the right social link yet. Like, I just need my lover's arcana and then I'm good to go. This place is so tiny, it's no wonder we can't find one. I mean, Yosuke, like, there's a girl who sits diagonal from you, right next to me. She would be a good pick for you. It doesn't matter if it's only a scooter. Some kind of motorcycle is just the ticket for us to get some chicks. Then, later on, we can get a bigger motorcycle. And that's when the up close and personal plan really starts. Damn it, Yosuke. Up close and personal? Plus, you know, you and me have more of a city boy thing going on. If we're serious about this, we've got to expand our horizons to a bigger town. We gotta take the initiative. There's no time to wait for a train that only leaves every so often each day. We'll roar up on our motorcycles like the badasses we are, and when the chicks come up, we'll play it cool. The pheromones dripping off of us will bring them around in no time. Sure. Fe feral zone? No, oh, we're not going to a cat house, you idiot. I'm talking about pheromones! Which humans do not actually produce. My research shows that a motorcycle is the number one surefire way to increase a man's pheromones. Except for the fact that humans don't produce pheromones. At least, I don't know. I'm pretty sure this hasn't been debunked, this hasn't been debunked in science yet. I'm pretty sure humans don't produce pheromones, but go off this. Pheromones? God damn it, Kachi. You have... Dude, that's how a perv would react. Yes, What'd you say? Fine, then I'm in too. Get ready for Kanji Tatsumi to show his manhood to these chicks. Phrasing. I already told you, you can't. Anyway, don't tell anyone about this, got it? If other guys try to copy us, it'll end up diluting our pheromones. So, partner, make sure you talk to your uncle about getting a license, okay? Got it. Not you. I don't even know your uncle. I'm serious about this. If we have motorcycles, we can go all over. It'll be fun! It's true that with the motorcycle, your range of activities will increase somewhat. Actually, yeah! Man, somewhere out there, the best days of our youth are ahead of us. I, I keep on forgetting that, um, Kanji is technically speaking the youngest member of the investigate. Oh. Okay, probably Teddy. But besides Teddy, Kanji is the youngest member of the investigation team. Um, I think it's in order. It's Kanji Naoto Rise or Kanji Rise Naoto, and then I don't know where the rest, where the other four sits. Um, because like Kanji is 15 for a good portion of this game. I don't know when his bir 15th, 16th birthday is. Yeah, I'll figure out my own time. Yeah, I'm with you on that one. You should try consulting the. Should you try consulting the gym about the motorcycle tonight? Classes have ended today. Will something else appear on the? Well, no one's appeared on TV, you. So take a guess. Hi. Did you hear? It seems like there's a gust at Tatsumi Shrine. That. Uh, hmm. Tatsuhime Shrine. If you go there at night, a woman's ghost will approach, and she threatens you unless you give her fish. Why fish, though? That's not something normal people carry around with them, you know. I don't know. I don't think I can go near the shrine for a while. Excuse me. I have another request. Will you hear me out? Listen, I have another request. After you brought me the angel statue, this time can you bring me a cruiser? <laughs> I'd like to keep it next to the angel. I uh, heard some scary news again. I'm scared to be in my room by myself. You got it. Wow. Thank you very much. Silver ones are, are pretty common. So something like a 
So something like a crooked cross would be nice. I think that would work. I'll be waiting for you. Okay. Uh, what can I do today? Can't hang out with the sports club. I don't want to go into the TV. Oh, yeah, actually, let's go talk to the fox. And see if we can get a new quest. Hmm. There's... Hmm. No, no social links at all. So, yeah, I think the fox is my best bet. Oh. Yeah, I don't have the... Uh, guts to hang out with... Um, what's her name? With... I, Ebihara. I might do one of my jobs. I think I can maybe do that. Okay, no, I doubt that the daycare center is open today. Let me actually just take a look at my notes here to see when is daycare open anyway. It's like, based on the fact that I didn't see it uh, there, I have a feeling it's not quite open. Uh, sports club... Monday, Friday, and Saturday is daycare, so yeah, definitely not. Uh, Fox. Accept the ammo request. You made sure there was no one around and called for the fox. Fox brought you an ammo with the wish written on it. It's written in thin, ladylike handwriting. I want to clear my mind of snacks. I want to hate them. It seems the socks want the socks. The fox wants you to fulfill the wish written on the Emma on its behalf. Could it be thinking that if wishes are fulfilled, there's more money will be put into the offertory box? If you fulfill the wish on the Emma, your relationship with the fox may grow stronger. Except the request? Yes. Because I want you to give me a higher discount when I do the things in the palace. Alright, uh, now we need to find the lady who wants to give up snacks. So, while we're here, let's actually just quickly look around for a lady who wants... Oh, wait, actually, let's take a look here. Oh, oh well. Um, I could... How much money do I have? I have 12k, so I could eat at Aya's, right? I don't really think I got anything else to do. I could study as well, but like eating at eyes is gonna literally buff way more things. So it's probably better that I eat at eyes. Though the thing is, eating at eyes is significantly more expensive. Okay, no, you're not the quest giver. Um. Oh, wait, isn't it that the quests only appear the day after you've consulted the fox? Uh, I, I really don't know. Um, okay. Yeah, I think... Yes? I, yeah. Alright, yeah, so let's just go hang out with Ayas. Wait, actually, hold on a second. I don't feel like I didn't do this. Maybe I did, I don't know. Okay, I did sell my stuff. Let us go to Ayas. I completely missed it. Yes. No, no, no. Okay, we're actually just going to look around a bit and check to see if we can find um, who has the quest. Then we'll come back here. Two very boring minutes later. Okay, yeah, I, I couldn't find anyone with a thing above their head, so I'm just gonna go and eat it. Ayas, so, yeah. Alright, accepted the rainy day. Still can't see the rice. Begin to suspect that your bowl is a portal to the meat dimension. The amount of meat contained within the bowl is truly really staggering. Give me my stats. Yay knowledge. Yay courage. Ooh, yes, I'm reliable. Ah, too bad, Mr. That will be 3,000 yen. Take my money. Thank you for the food. Ah, 
You're back. Hi yeah, there. Indeed. Hey, Adachi. You want some meal too? Fair warning, it's from the supermarket. Well, excuse me. It's delicious, though. I can't believe it was on sale. <laughs> Sorry, but this guy eats instant noodles every day. That constant slurping got on my nerves, so I called him here. You don't have to bluff like that. You just wanted to eat dinner with a coworker, right? Don't be stupid. But Eel was a great choice. Nanako-chan loved it, at least. I'd say she's eely proud of her daddy. Huh? Huh? Ah, you and Teddy would get along. Did my joke slip away? It is an eel, after all. Just eat your dinner. Y yes, sir. Nanako-chan's such a good girl, though. She went straight to do her homework once her plate was clean. It's not every day you get to eat eel. You'd think she would have spent some more time savoring it. You think that because you slack off too much. You should follow her example. <laughs> the, the time when an adult says to another adult that you should follow the example of a six-year-old girl. <clears throat> Way to hit where it hurts. You need to consult Ojima about getting a motorcycle license. What's the matter? A motorcycle? You mean a scooter? Oh, that's right. Kids your age can ride those. I don't know, though. Come on, don't be a spoil sport. It's no surprise he wants one out here. I understand how you feel since I'm from the city myself. The trains don't run that often, and walking around everywhere is pretty inconvenient, isn't it? It's a hassle. Right? It's criminal. You say that, but... That reminds me, I remember you telling me something once, Dojima-san, about some of the reckless things you did on your motorcycle when you were young. You moron. Think before you talk. And once you're done eating, hurry and... Ugh. Who summons the... Me? Hmm. All right. We'll be there soon. Looks like I made the right choice to skip the booze. Adachi. You were the one in charge of that file, right? File? Oh, did that suspicious guy show up again? Oh, okay. Would you keep your mouth shut? We're going back. Get in the car. Back? You mean to the station? But I haven't had my eel liver soup yet. <laughs> so she... Ma, you're too hard on the kid. About this license. Did you decide on this yourself? No one talked you into it. I know it's hard without a way to get around, but two-wheeled vehicles can be dangerous. Do you understand? I'll be careful with it. I'm sure I can trust you to do that. But allowing you to get one is another thing. The Dojima seems troubled. Don't give me that face. I, I know you're serious about this. First, you need a license. We can talk about this again when you have one. Well then, sorry to dump this on you, but I need you to look after the house. Sure, no problem, Chief. Dojima is so much stricter than than Sojiro. It's from Yosuke. Yo, it's me. How did it go with your uncle? I've been on the edge of my seat thinking about it. Seriously? Then let's go get ours as soon as we can. I gotta hit the books. Let's make sure we both pass together. You got it, Chief. I'm pretty sure to study. I'm pretty sure for the um the license for scooters. Uh, oh wow, the test is tomorrow. Hectic. You wonder about that suspicious guy that she mentioned. There's no way to find out. Uh, find out more about it now. Should review the manual Yeske gave you and study for the license exam. Yeah, I'm pretty sure like it's like automatic that you pass the exam since it's a big part of the game You see it in the trailers Trailers in the opening morning Yasuke seems sleepy. I went to bed but little details kept bugging me So I get up again to check the manual it never ended. I ended up getting almost no sleep at all Well, if we're gonna do this this pass on the first try, how are you feeling? It'll be a breeze <laughs> now that's my partner. Uh, you see, I haven't forgotten about our up and up close and personal plan. Uh, let's make sure we're not late to the exam. We'll leave as soon as school's out. Pass over. Promise Yosuke that you would go with him to your license after school to today.
Take the license exam with Yosuke. The answers seem to be flowing from your hand. Yay. Whoa. <laughs> we passed on the first try. Just like we planned. Actually, it was pretty easy. I might have studied a little too hard. There's nothing wrong with studying hard for a driver's license. Hi! Are you on duty? We just stopped by to get gas and, well, to take care of some minor business. Where did you guys go? We got our licenses. Already? You got. <laughs> I do not waste time. I know it's just a written test to get a scooter license, but still, I wasn't expecting you to pass so soon. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh well. Looks like I'd better think of a way to convince my sister. Thank you! I can't say no now that you've gotten your license. Your enthusiasm is catching. Yes! You got the okay! I need to head home and read through the catalog. Well, see you tomorrow! Cheers! Mind if I borrow you a sec before you head back home? Sure! Hey, Adachi! I just finished filling it up. Sorry for dragging you into this. This is my scooter. I had it fixed at the shop. It may be old, but it runs pretty well. I came to put gas in it, but I wasn't expecting to hand it over today, too. I'm letting you have it. This is a nice bike, thank you! You can tell? The local shops don't carry twist grips, so I had one of the repair guys at work help me out with it in secret. Uh, don't tell anyone that, okay? My lips are sealed. The only people who will know is all of YouTube who will be watching this. By all of YouTube, I mean like the two people who watch my videos. Thank you for watching my videos, guys. Dojima's passion for scooters, obvious. You're always so strict at the station, but you're a cool dad inside, huh? Shut up, Adachi. You always yell at me. Hey, Dojima, don't be like that. Adachi just wants a father figure. Still, I wish we had a sleek means of transportation like that. Who knows when that suspicious guy will show up again? Hasn't he been using professional quality cameras to take pictures of people's houses from the Amagi Inn to around here? Looks like he knows the back streets, too. So a car won't be. Will you stop blabbering like that? Go back to the car. Thanks for the plot convenience, Adachi. Well, anyway, I was around your age when I got my license, too. I took the test behind my parents' back. When my dad caught me riding a scooter later on, he gave me a good thrashing. <laughs> Don't tell Nanako about that, okay? My lips are sealed. Dojima, Dojima is chuckling nervously, mischievously. Since I've already given the okay, I won't bug you about traffic laws. Just be safe when you're riding it. You do that, and I'll look the other way if you decide to ride it out of town. Can you promise me? Good. I'll hold you to that. See Dojima scooter. Um, I honestly, I feel like I wanna. Do I wanna take a ride on the scooter just before we end? Oh wait, we can hang out with Kanji. Ooh, that's also very. I'm not. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do it. Take a long run. Fine. Right around the neighborhood. I'm gonna do this, and then we're gonna hang out with Kanji in another day. Probably in another video as well. After getting completely lost, you reach the station, but you feel as you're starting to get a feel for the place. You need to ride around to be a little more to get better acquainted with the area. Hey, courage. You're back. Oh yeah, a package came for you. It's on the table over there. Ooh, yay. Let's take a look at this new thing. This is... So significantly worse than what we got. 
Yeah, sure. Take it. <laughs> Jeez, we need to buy armor for everyone. No wonder we keep taking so much damage. Jeez. Okay, you can take the chain mail. How much time do I have on this? Okay, three days. Alright then, uh, thank you all so much for watching ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed this video be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe for more content on this channel. Until next time, this is Cyber signing out. Peace.